Hello. Hi, boys and girls. So I'm going to teach you a new song. And this is a little, there's a little bit of a story behind it. And we want to talk about it. It's connected to Black History Month of February. And the song is called This Little Light of Mine. And um, I'll just tell you a little bit about the song. So there is some... There's some stories about where the song came from that are not true. There's a little bit of mystery to where it came from. Some people thought it was sung by black people during slavery while they worked, but that is not true. Um, it, the song was written later on in the 1920s. And what happened was in the 1950s and the 1960s in America and around the world, there was a civil rights movement and civil rights what was happening was that African Americans were protesting and standing up for their right to be treated fairly and equally to everybody else. And there was a lot of tension and conflicts in America and around the world. And this song was sung by some of those people protesting and fighting for their right to be equal. And it's a great song because um, it, we're singing when we're talking about a light it's that thing inside of you that makes you special and unique and we all have different things that make us special and unique and so this song makes you feel strong and in a situation I'll give you a little bit of an example of a story there was a famous story there was a civil rights leader a woman named Fanny Lou, Fanny Lou Hamer, who, while she was being detained by the police, so the police took her, and because she had tried to register to vote, and just for doing that with some other people, the police came and, and took her after she tried to register to vote. And while the police had her, she began singing this song and everyone, people started to join in. And that's what, another reason why this song is tied to civil rights is because it's, there's not too many words and it's easy for people to just to hear it and then join in. So you might know the song and you, you might not. The main verse of the song goes, this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. So this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine So that's the main verse that we would sing a number of times let it, at the end, notice how we sing, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. And we always sing that. And then what happens is that we, in, when we change, some, what would happen when they were doing it back then, someone might call out a line before they sing it. Everywhere I go. So then they just change those three words and everything else is the same. So everywhere I go. I'm gonna let it shine Everywhere I go I'm gonna let it shine Everywhere I go I'm gonna let it shine Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine Let's do the first verse <clears throat> and the second verse all together, okay? Let's try it together. And then the third verse, I'll call it out. It's going to be all around the world. So. One, two, three, four. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine. Um, next verse, everywhere I go. Two, three, four. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine. 
Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. And all around the world, all around the world, I'm gonna let it shine. All around the world, I'm gonna let it shine. All around the world, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Go back to the first verse. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. All right. There are some other chords that I could do. If I was playing piano, I would play them, but I can't really do them very well on ukulele. So that's the words. I'll share the words with your teacher. And you can also just try singing it um, together without this video. You could just try and sing it that way. Um, you could look up different versions of it. There's a lot of different um, words that were added as years went by and people kept adding new verses. But we're just going to stick with those three verses. And we'll sing the first verse, This Little Light of Mine, twice. And then we'll sing Everywhere I Go. And then we'll sing All Around the World. And then we'll sing, we'll come back to the first verse, This Little Light of Mine. And you might want to talk and think about community. Because this song is a song that when people, what community is and how this song is connected to community. Okay, because during the civil rights, this was in a lot during the 1960s, but also in the 50s. Um, there was all the people that were protesting. They were a community of people working together, standing up for what was right. And this song helped uh, tie that community of people together to give them strength. Okay, so that's something else to think about. What is community and how this song is connected to that. Okay, have fun. Bye-bye.